According to believers in overpopulation, there are so many of us on the planet that food production cannot possibly keep up. However, according to both the UN's Food and Agricultural Organization and the World Food Program, there is currently enough food on the planet for everyone to be well fed. Not only that, but we're growing this food on less land than we did in the past. This is why in the United States, for example, the government can afford to pay farmers not to grow food, but instead return their farmland to the wild. Modern technology also allows us to grow food on land where it would have been impossible to do so, even a few years ago. Agricultural experts even believe that Africa, if cultivated using modern farming methods, could eventually feed the whole world, all by itself. Then why are people in many parts of the world starving? The World Food Program lists key causes of hunger, and overpopulation is not on that list. War, one of the leading causes of world hunger, destroys crops and disrupts relief efforts. Widespread poverty prevents many from buying the food that they need. And a lack of infrastructure means that there isn't a reliable way to transport food to areas that need it. This is why reducing the number of hungry people will not make the remaining people less hungry. Those who have access to the food will continue to have access to it, and those who don't will still be hungry. Reducing population will not magically cause food to be spread around equally. And blaming overpopulation for everything does nothing but distract us from the real problems that we actually have. Think about it.